Stanford University. The basic objective of this uh, program is to develop um, a new technology that enables to convert electrical energy into chemical energy. But we're using the capacity of biology, specifically of microorganisms, to produce interesting chemicals. So what these organisms typically do, um, they use CO2 from the atmosphere and use hydrogen and basically form methane as their end product, which allows them to grow and thrive. And our approach is to use simply CO2, for atmospheric CO2, and electrical energy to produce this. So what we are testing in this system is um, whether uh, uh, microbes can use electrons that are provided here through these cables uh, into the uh, cathode, into this electrode, and use CO2 and make interesting compounds out of this. For example, methane or acetate or isoprenes and, 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 and other uh, compounds. In the end, you want to have a system that you switch on and the microorganisms produce methane for a long time, for weeks. Uh, the advantage is that if you use atmospheric CO2, these hydrocarbons can be then used as fuels. And they can be used in chemical industry to make new products, which can be then ultimately combusted. This is all uh, in a CO2 neutral way. And that's fundamentally different from how we're using petroleum compounds uh, currently. For more, please visit us at stanford.edu.